Stevens. Hey. <laughs> How's it going? Good. Thanks for taking the time out of your busy schedule putting hackers behind bars. Yeah, well, no problem. We could do uh, help you revamp security around here, prevent some future attacks. So, where do we get started? Well, you said you already started to crack down on your security within all your systems and network, right? Yes. Our IT guys have the technical side taken care of. So ultimately, you just need to get everybody to realize that security rests on all of their shoulders, right? Exactly. Yeah. Okay, so what else have you tried? We sent quite a few employees to the cybersecurity conference, but that didn't do much good, unfortunately. We've also tried to implement BYOD policies and computer security standards, but it feels like no one is taking it seriously. If something doesn't change soon, I'm afraid I'm going to have to start disciplining my employees for violating company policy. It's really frustrating, you know? I work with some highly intelligent people that are amazing at their jobs. I don't want to feel like I have to babysit them. No, I get what you mean. It makes sense. That's why your first step should be setting up your core work group. You, know, you got to think who are the individuals that are going to be able to pull this off and make it a success. What I really mean is who within your security management team should play a role in your organization. We need more than just a list of generalities like chief security officer or someone from the security operations center. What I'm asking of you is to be able to not only be able to make a list of people, but be able to put each person's position down next to it. You know, also think about when you are implementing a CSC program that you need to first understand the end result well enough to select the correct people. Okay, but why would putting the name down matter? Uh, because the position isn't all that matters. I mean, yeah, it does matter to some degree, but what you really want to do is select people that you know are going to care about what you're doing. You know, they're not going to just kick all these regulations to the curb the second that you're not watching. <laughs> know exactly what you mean. I can think of a couple of people right now would like nothing more than to get rid of this whole idea. Exactly. That's why you've got to choose wisely, right? I mean, having somebody from, you know, a senior management team member is great, but you need somebody from IT and security. I'd even recommend somebody from the legal department or HR, or marketing, even communications. I can think of several people from each department that would be great. Excellent. This group will need to establish a written policy, of course, and some sort of a strategy uh, relating to the proper formation of the CSC program. This all sounds great. I'll get to work putting the team together.